Hi guys, I am back with another video. This video is to show you three different ways to record your screen on your Samsung Galaxy Note 8. Two of them can also be used on other Android phones because they are apps found in the Play Store. So make sure you stay tuned and watch and see how it's done. Started. The first way to record is in your actual phone. So you go, pull this down, and over here in the corner you see performance mode. I don't know where yours is located. This is where I set mine at. Just go to performance mode, hold it down. I'm going to go to game. And then you see right here, game launcher is on. You want to apply. So now that is on. You want to go back out of here. And I'm just going to use an app. See, with this one, you actually have to be in an app to record your screen. You cannot record like I'm right here on this. You cannot record this. You have to actually be in an app. So I'm just going to go in eBay just for an example. And then on the, on the side right here at the bottom, you see this. You press it and you will see all your little settings that you can do. No alerts while using the app. Or press home lock, home button lock, edge touch lock and all the other ones. And right here at the bottom, you'll see record. And you will press that. But right now, I'm recording my screen, so it will not do it. See, watch. If I do that, it say, can't record microphone in use. But anyway, anything I do within this app, it will record it. But right now, you know, I can't record it. So it will record it, and the way to get out of it is if you stop recording or you just get out of the app, and it'll automatically stop recording. And you usually will go into your gallery and it'll be listening in your gallery. It's not listening to my gallery right now because I didn't record anything. But you'll see it in your gallery in um, your albums. And then that's how you will see what you recorded. But the second one is this one right here. You see it say play games. You go to that. And right here, um, you will come in here. You have to have a game downloaded in here. I just downloaded this game right here just for the purpose of this video. And you see at the bottom right here, say record gameplay. Now this one, you don't have to only record while you're playing. So you'll press it just to get into it. And right here, say 720p HD or 480p SD. And you pick which one you want. I want the 720, so then you launch it. Okay, so I'm gonna have to do a voiceover because this game was entirely too loud and I didn't realize it. So anyway, that's the camera right here. You can turn it on and turn it off. And right here's the, the voice, the volume. You can speak in it or you can turn it off if you don't want to talk in it. And so this is record right here, the little record button. This is the camera. So if you want to turn it off, you can go and you can turn it off. Or you can leave it on and you can record. But you don't have to just record in apps. You can record elsewhere. And see the little thing is still here so now i can actually record the actual screen if i want to see now it's counting down so now it's recording along with me recording and then we're going to do a little something just to see if it picks it up but even if it don't pick it up it's because i'm recording with another recorder but it'll record any and everything that you're doing and then you go back to it you can stop it right here So let's see now. Go in gallery and see if we can find it. Where would it be? And it'll be listed in here. It may not have recorded because I'm recording using something else. But anyway, here you go. Screencast right here. And that's what would be listed in here in screencast. So, and that's how you record. And I have one more recorder. Okay, so then the last recorder is this one right here. And that's what it looks like. You go to that. And then in here, you want to put your duration, how long you want to record. If you want it to be heard, what you're saying. You click that. And then, of course, the file name. You press record and it records any and everything. It records any of your um, games. It records any videos. It records anything you're doing on the screen. So 
you know, I like this last one a lot, but only think about it, you can't record yourself at the same time. So that's why I think this one right here is the best one. The play games one is the best one as far as recording because it records everything and it records your voice. You can turn it off or record you and you'll be in the little corner too. So I just want to come and show you guys three ways because people keep asking me how do I record my videos. For the most part, I use this recorder right here. I'm going to use this one when I want to record myself. And then the one, the other one is more for gaming or being an app. So I won't use that one so much. But some people may not ever want to record nothing but apps. So, you know, it's, it's cool as far as that goes. So. All right, guys, make sure you subscribe to my channel if you hadn't already. Subscribe to my other channel if you hadn't already. Make sure you check me out on social media. Leave comments below. Let me know what you think about this. Which one would you rather use? Have you used any of these? If you know some other um, ways to record your screen, leave those comments below. Thank you guys for watching. No, 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 no.